In this video, you're going to learn what active release is and how it can help you. Now, active release is also known as a ART, and it is something that has been around for about, I'd say, since 2000 or 1999, I think. It's been around a little while. But for the most part, a lot of people have not heard about it. It's a very specific form of deep tissue work. I think it works really well for a lot of cases, but not others. And that's a quick disclaimer I'll give you, is I definitely have a lot of people who come into my office asking for it, but really don't need it. They need something else. They need strength training. They need rehab and so on. But usually when you do need it, it's because of over uh, excessive scar tissue formation. And I've used this demo, the mop, quite a bit in the past. And when I first started doing sports injuries, um, this is something that resonated really well with people. So I'm going to do a more advanced version here. We're going to use a GoPro. So with the GoPro, we're going to look in here and see that all these muscle fibers here the ones at the top are the ones I did not dip in paint. Now they're really separable, uh, you're able to separate and so on, but when we go down here and I dip this in paint and left it overnight, we have these little clumps, we have these big clumps, we have, I think this is the good one. This is the one where two clumps are stuck together. And this would be a representation of two muscles not sliding. You do need muscles to slide. You need to decrease friction and you need to make sure that everything working well really in your body to decrease the amount of uh, chronic injury and irritation to get to an area. So with active release, basically what we're doing is we're going in with our hands and just kind of separating these things apart. And granted, it is very, it's normal to have scar tissue or fibrous tissue to form here. Think about it like when you break a bone, your bone has to heal up. Doesn't mean it's bad to have it heal up and some people say that the bone's actually stronger in the end for it. Now muscles kind of the same way. You have this big clump here, this big clump here, and it hardened that way because the body's trying to remodel it. It's trying to it's trying to make it stronger so it doesn't rip apart again. But the problem is that sometimes you get too much. And when you get too much you have to make sure that it goes down a little bit and that's what manual therapy will be, will be very helpful for especially in under six months of after having the injury or after your pain develops but I would say all, all the way up and towards a year it's actually very productive to do so so active release is basically that specific soft tissue work if you need uh, if you need any some place to actually find how to do it go ahead and email us uh, it'll be very very helpful in a lot of cases in many cases have a strong response usually within four or five times and again it's not to say that it actually fixes the whole condition but it really assists in decreasing pain and it's really hard to rehab really well if you're in pain and you're moving very faulty so thanks again i'm dr sebastian gonzalez our contact information is below and if